I feel like I wanted to be an artist as soon as I could hold a crayon. I come from a pretty creative family, but not everyone's an artist. We're all um, creative in different ways. Caroline Simus uses her art to beautify her beloved hometown of Fort Mill, South Carolina. Her artwork downtown encourages people to come walk around and engage with others, bringing business back to these once sleepy shops. As far as public art goes, I really have wanted to do a mural before and it made sense to me in my hometown. I'm excited to have it back and I really love the idea of interactive um, murals because I think it invites the public to come and participate in the community. Last May, Caroline worked with Leslie Hancock to make the Love Where You Live mural a reality. Taking over 20 hours to create, it was a labor of love. For me, the mural represents, it's kind of like light and airy and it's fun. It's a fun thing to do and I think it's very cool that we have that in our own little downtown Fort Mill. But Caroline wasn't always an artist. For over six years, she was a teacher and hopes to use her gift to help others with their own. I love the fact that you can match art with uplifting messages that hopefully um, let people remember why they're giving the gift and who they're trying to bless in that process and just that really every day is a gift. In order to share her passion, she works side by side with Leslie, who makes her material masterpieces into gorgeous graphics that can easily be shared with others, showing us that her artwork isn't strictly street side figure out what you love and what you're passionate about. If you can try and make that into a career, you will never feel like you're working a day in your life because you're doing what you really love. For PBS NewsHour Student Reporting Labs, I'm Courtney Smith in Fort Mill, South Carolina.